Today is calcium contract day because uh, we, we need to drink more milk. You got to get a lot of calcium. You got to strengthen those bones. It's very important because after a certain age, now this is scientifically proven, uh, the, 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 the bone density drops. So, you know, drink your fucking milk. So I say to my kids, drink your fucking milk. No. They like drinking it anyway. They, they just like, you know, chalky milk. Chalky milk, strawberry milk. Not so, I'm not so sure about the banana milk. Banana flavor. I've never been big on the banana flavor. I'm more of a, uh, like, a strawberry. Strawberry flavor. I've come around on vanilla lately. Bit of vanilla. Vanilla is not a plain flavor. I feel vanilla gets a, a bad rap. And I'm hoping that all of the recording doohickeys that I've got going right now uh, play nice. Because, uh, cause yeah. i got all of them running. I was doing some research not too long ago uh, with regards to how many things individually I can record at any given time on my GPU. And there's this wonderful encoder called NVENC. It really reduces file sizes and, and takes a lot of the strain off of your GPU when you're recording the screen. And I found out that you could use it to say, record this entire thing, everything that's going on. You can record a separate background element, like just, you know, the webcam here as a full screen webcam. And what I wanted to do is also re record like a clean, ah fuck, record a clean background of just the footage. No extra sound effects, no me going over the top of it. And I can separate the audio out, but the footage, that requires another encoding stream. And a GPU can only, well, I think my GPU can only do two NVENC encoding streams before things start getting fucky. So I've got, Hold on, I'm counting. I'm counting to three. I've got two MVENC streams, so that's taken up. If I wanted to record the the through OBS this, that would be a separate stream that I'd need to encode through my CPU. My brain's dying. I'm trying to explain this and it doesn't make any fucking sense. I'm just gonna play calcium contract. And if things brain injury. Exactly. And if things go smoothly, I, I hope to maybe put together a video for it because I, I I really like this game. Well, I adored the demo. I absolutely adored the demo. It's it's just it's vibes. <sighs> anyway. There's my toggles. All that lives must die. This ancient contract has to be fulfilled. You are Calcium Order's last resort. Okay. Nugget, you just watched Amazing Digital Circus with some friends? No idea what that is. The island where you're headed turned into chaos. A personal playground of the bird serpent. You can see it terrifyingly. <laughs> It looks like a bunch of fuzzy balls stuck together with a chicken head. The serpent rejected the contract and is growing ever more powerful, gathering minions. You are the only one who can put an end to this. Who who thought you can just choose to not die? It's a revolutionary concept, isn't it? Like, yeah, your time's up and you go, <laughs> lol, no. All that lives must die. In the long history of the Order, there have been no exceptions. Make sure the bird serpent will not be the first one. It was basically Hitman if you were a skeleton. Afterlife Hitman. But I, I kinda, I just, I don't know. There's just something about Calcium Contract that is unlike any other kind of retro-styled FPS. And I love it for that. <laughs> Even if I get the shit kicked out of me by a goat demon. Do I have any ranged option yet, or is it just the scythe? Angry scythe. Heretic clone. That's awfully reductive, isn't it? Besides, heretic's great. 
I might not have to do any pterodactyl screeching. The, the, the character's doing it for me. The only problem I have with bringing up Heretic is when you bring up Heretic and it inevitably makes me think of Hexen, and I hate Hexen. <laughs> trying to remember, who was it? The, the guy in charge of Xbox gaming? He is angling for a Hexen remake. Or at least a Hexen continuation. I mean, we have Hexen too. But he wants Hexen. I'm like, be, be careful what you wish for. Have you played Hexen recently? Have you played it recently, Phil? My only criticism so far is that my tiny skulls on my weapon aren't tooting. I mean, they are kind of spitting, but you know. I just like the slap, and it ricochets. I think he's dead. Sadrax, one eighth of the puzzle has been solved. Two eighths of the puzzle was. Oh no! Oh no! I just remembered I kind of upped the um the bits text to speech thing. I'm sorry. I should have told everyone about that. Five hundred. May have increased it to 500. I was messing around with my donation settings earlier and I, I kind of put it a blanket, like five bucks. I'm sorry. Sorry. You, you, you're really going to want to save up 500, 500 bucks. 500 bits. Five dollars. I want to buy more five dollar footlongs. They import them specially. Inflation, man. I gotta move with the times. Nah, I was doing a little bit of a spruce up of all my um, my notifications and such, and I was screwing around with the TTS testing earlier just to see if I could add stuff. I didn't expect the sniper things this early. I was trying to add stuff that would actively screw with me in a way that doesn't piss me off endless endlessly. I thought about adding one of those... Uh, one of those knocking sound effects that plays in one of my ears to freak me out while I'm playing something spooky this month, but then I realized I occasionally do need to listen out for someone knocking on my door because <laughs> because I got kids, damn it. Sometimes my services are required. Get back here. What the fuck? How am I supposed to chase after that? Get back here. No! Five hundred bits is eight dollars and eighty-five. Eight, 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 eighty-five. Eight, eighty-five. Sorry, I absolutely did not take into account conversion. Oh my god! Jesus! You asked for this. It's a lot of skellies. Plus, now by default, it plays the cyber demon noise, so that, that's infinitely cooler. I think this is a value add, all things considered. Ah, uh, dear me. Line, you don't recommend the, uh, what, the audio thing? And he was playing Resident Evil 4. <laughs> Ashley, in game, screamed your name and got confusing. First few hours, you couldn't tell it was the game or the people around me. Oh, like, screwing with you. Ah. Anyway. I have been, I have been utterly spoilt for choice. When it comes to games that I want to play. Because, you know, the other thing is, I still want to continue playing Lies of P. Grenades, ooh. I've just not had time. I was finishing up a video, I was I was getting some extra stuff done. I've started uploading commentary-free uh, playthroughs for people who hate my voice. 
uh, over on the secondary channel. So one of those should be live right now. I actually redid uh, an entire run of Realism 2's boss rush mode because I wasn't happy with the download quality from YouTube. So I just did it again. Because I'm, uh, I'm, 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 I'm an OG like that. An old git. Ellie, you like my voice? Oh, that's nice. But, you know, I'm, I'm trying to, I'm trying to cater to the people that, you know, just want to watch someone play Doom without voices. So, we'll see if that works. At the very least, there'll be some extra content on the secondary channel. When's the final at Resident Evil 6 stream? Ugh. Oh. I got so much on my plate, man. I would like to upload that. It's just like people will be so confused when I do. I love the sound that this weapon makes, by the way. I absolutely love it. EOV, you're murdering enemies with a xylophone. The fire's bones! I feel like there's more levels than there were before. Or at least, uh, I... I played through a different selection of levels in the demo. These... 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 these gets. Let's see if I can ricochet on them. I got them. I got them. You Twitch badges? Yes! This is what happens when I get enough free time of a morning away from feeding babies to, uh... To tinker with stuff. I've not had a lot of tinkering time. And you forget how important tinkering time actually is. Especially when it comes to figuring out things you want to improve, tweak, mess with... Maybe even games that you want to play. I mean, tinkering time... Woo! was uh, what led me to play this today, which I am not regretting, by the way. I'm not regretting. Even when my computer is gone, I will still watch you, you lovable bastard. <laughs> Topping, thank you so much. 14 months with Prime. Much appreciated. So you watching mobile? Dedication. So. Uzrik, the levels are in a different order on the main campaign as to the demo. Ah, okay. That makes sense. Oh, there is an auto map. There we go. I, I can't quite convey how satisfying this actually is. Oh shit. It's one of those, uh, it's one of those things. It just works. It just works. Your computer got fried. Fired? Fried? Fried or fired, a few days ago at Topping. Right during my last stream. <sighs> Good grief. Fifty-seven months. Thank you so much. You know what I just realized? There is like uh, an angle of ricochet. So, it's got to be after a certain angle for the ricochet to end. Oh, wait, does it? Yeah. I think it's related to the service. So they've been... They've been preparing for my arrival. The 
first agent did not expect any complications with the contract. Ah, I'm not the first. Good grief. It turned out to be sorely mistaken. Poor guy. Is that you? You don't have to say if you're embarrassed. This is fun. Ozriki love the wacky enemy types in this. Jesters who teleport enemies around and cry if you stun them. Yeah, the, there's so many different interesting like enemy attributes. It's not just the look, it's what they do. It's neat. It's really neat. Speaking of which, chase a chicken. Where did he go? What the hell? Get back here. Get back here! There's a second one? My god, I'm, I'm accidentally speedrunning this level because I'm chasing after a treasure chicken. I do recognize this one, by the way. I love how these fellas die as well. Just Oh, and, uh, yeah. <laughs> that is Birdsurfing playing peekaboo in the skybox. I love how the skybox shifts as you play through these levels. It's great. <laughs> Swallow your soul. You can chase a chicken on stream, but I better not choke it. Kinsey. This is a family friendly stream. Anyway. Any more cocks chasing after me? Yep. God, look at the size of them. They're huge. Are they cocks or packers? That's gone smoothly so far. Oh, oh damn it. Health. I like the amount of warning you get with the, uh, the kitty snipers. When you charge the scythe, the three little angry skulls nibble on it. Yeah! And you can- Wow, I didn't plan that, but it was cool anyway. I just, uh... <laughs> I just parried a projectile. <laughs> Entirely by accident. That's a grenade. Can I pick that back up or is it- Oh, no. No, let's not do that. Lion, one thing you've always appreciated by this is the more interactive weapons. They do something different. Yeah, the little skellies help you reload. Also, full retail game. Not a mod. Well worth it, in my opinion. Oh, good. More subs. Yes, please. This is the only way I'm going to be doing this years from now on. I you enjoy. Also, I feel like I should inform you here because you don't check your Discord server that I will be away next week. So hopefully someone else will be here to allow the funny bad words that I have on locks. Rick is skelm, Rick is skelm. Sorry, the volume in game is far too loud. <laughs> let, let me let me turn it down a little. So what was that again? The only way you're gonna be doing TTS. Well, thank you for the 43 months either way. I feel like you should inform because I don't check my Discord server, you'll be away. I do check it, I just don't talk. <laughs> I, I I suffer from that affliction known as mentally acknowledging a message but not actually telling anyone else so yeah. noted <laughs> anyway let's check let's check well on custom custom engine this that's super impressive as well there's something there's just something 
eminently cozy about this game. It reminds me of the kind of games I used to find on like shareware discs back in the day. But, you know. A full game. Personality, you know? Quirk! Did I end up trying the Robocop demo? I'd love to, I've just not had time. I have not had time. I found that my limit for, for stuff I can juggle at the moment is like vastly diminished. Even demos. I checked out absolutely nothing during Next Fest. So now I'm just relying on uh, what everyone else has been checking out. Oh. I wonder if you can inflict any damage with the... Uh... Oh shit, the cocks are back. With those ricocheting gas bags. Ooh. The the damage noise actually occasionally reminds me of uh was it the quake damage noise? Or quake two damage noise. It's the Yelp. Last Exterminator was a nice little demo. I have played that. I, I did play that on stream. Most most of the playing of stuff that I get done these days is actually here on stream. This is this is where I get the opportunity to just check stuff out. Cause uh you I got three mouths to feed, man. Last train home. Tr last train home looks really good. RTS based on Czech White Legion. Ah, I did see. I think I saw the trailer for that during the Realms Deep. I was trying to think of something else as well. Brain's gone. Can't remember it. Man, some of them treasure chickens. They have zero chill. I just feel like they're mocking me. Remind me of the, uh... Is it the goblins? Not the goblins. Gremlin? Goblin? Imp? Whatever the one you call it. That thing had a golden axe! They used to, uh, you know, occasionally, you know, run around. I remembered what I was going to say now, in terms of uh, interesting games. I want to play a bit of that El Paso elsewhere, because I love Max Payne. And anything that seeks to give a little bit of that vibe, I am, I am down for. Ever played Golden Axe Monkey? I think in between rounds there used to be this little... little uh, Goblin with a sack that would run around. He keeps thwacking him. He got treasure! Man, I gotta watch out for that salamander fire. That... That just goes over terrain like nobody's business. It just puts a smile on my face. It really does. You buying uh, Robocop on release, Divic? Team's pretty great so far. Taeon, is it? Taeon. Still play that Terminator game. I want to play the expansion. Uh, I, I completed the main playthrough. I never played uh, Annihilation Line, which is the, uh, the expansion for it. I heard it's quite good. But yeah, they have they have absolutely proven their uh, the worth. God damn it! When it comes to uh, how they treat these franchises, unlike that King Kong game that's doing the rounds right now. Good grief! Shovelware is back, baby. Franchise shovelware is back in fucking fashion. If you don't know what I'm talking about, don't worry. It's going to be fucking everywhere on YouTube relatively soon. These little kitty bastards. I hate them. Hit scanners. Oh. 
I keep forgetting to use these grenades. They, they're not registering as grenades to me yet because I've just got blue orbs. Ooh. Didn't expect that to work as well as it did. <laughs> it is an ominous noise. I love the reload mechanic in this, by the way. As in the, the save mechanic, or the lack of save mechanic. Last time I saw that done was in the Duke Nukem uh, World Tour release. Where instead of, like, um, hard saves, you can just go back along a timeline. And you can do that with this. You can just press space to go back five seconds, or you can actually scroll a timeline, and it will actually tell you notable events that you've achieved during the level, say, like, picking up a particular key. It'll show you on that timeline, and you can just go back to that part of the save or the playthrough. It's, it's really actually good. I know a lot of people didn't like its implementation much in, um, in Duke Nukem 3D World Tour, but I... I mean... I appreciate it here. It is very cool. If I get myself killed in a sec, I can show you what the full timeline's like. Just let all these gang up on me. Oh, there's the Jester. So, if I press control... I can now scroll back the entire level all the way to the beginning if I wanted to. Or to where I picked up the red key. Or, yep, back to the green key, which is what I'm going to do. Really useful. Completely takes any worry about checkpoints or quick saving off the table. Oh, no, didn't want to do that. So yeah, jesters can teleport enemies around the place. I think I missed my opportunity with the treasure chicken, though. There's a few other enemies that, um... have big clocks. I'm not quite sure what the big clocks do. Maybe they speed up enemies or slow you down, but it's like, it, it is... Of course, something temporal related. I unlocked myself? What? I wasn't checking the achievements. <laughs> so... So far I've found the level layout pretty straightforward so far. Last few levels. Maybe that second level had me running around a bit. But nothing terrible. Been relatively short and sweet so far. There was an achievement called Icarus. Oh! I'll have to check that when I'm back on the, uh, the Steam page. Does anything not reset exactly when you go back in the timeline? I don't know. As far as I can tell, it's, it's it's exactly what it is, like a rewind function. It'll rewind everything back to its position. You can see it being used for puzzles. I'm not sure it's implemented in that way. I think it's just in a saving progress capacity. <laughs> Cheeky bastard. I like how the treasure chicken encourages you to take risks. Oh, you want this? You want this spicy treasure, yeah? You have to chase me! Aggro all these enemies in the process. Because I think 
you pistol start every level here. You don't carry your weapon from level to level. Your weapon re. Your arsenal. Oh, you can squish them. Don't eat the blue mushrooms, by the way. Bad trip. God, not again. Where's the chicken? Where's the chicken? Chicken! 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 <laughs> Lured to my death. Alright. Snake, are you okay? Snake? Snake! Stopping if you eat the blue mushroom, you turn to a smurf, and the only smurf woman you can get, it, get with the smurf head. Why does every, everything come back to that monologue out of Donnie Darko about the Smurfs and Smurfette? Where's that? Where is he? Yeah! So, a bit of, bit of attack speed increase. Pretty good. Oh, health goes over 100. So, what does this fella do? Vastly increases the speed of uh, nearby enemies. Slows you down in terms of firing speed, I think. So does that slow down movement? Not quite sure about that one. It has an effect on you either way. Lava, are you behind or did Twitch add vertical video stories? It did. Uh, I don't know why. I think everyone just wants a piece of that TikTok pie, don't they? It's largely for people who use mobile, as far as I can tell. Not sure I've spotted the implementation of it on the... Uh, on desktop, which is where I do 90% of my Twitch usage, if I'm going to be honest. I don't use Twitch much on my phone. Oh! I wonder why I was taking damage. This just slows you down. It doesn't damage you. Every time I hear, like, those enemies meowing, it reminds me of a video about a cat that meows in Scouse. If you don't know what the Scouse accent's like... Well, you could look that up first and then listen to the cat. That's true. That's true. Will they add audio in chat rooms? What? I have no idea what's going on with Twitch in terms of what they choose to add. It's like YouTube adding like a specific function where if you say like or subscribe during the course of the video, apparently it can detect when that is said on the watch page and highlights the relevant buttons on the page as they're said. And then, if you click them, apparently you get a little, a little explosion of sparkles to, to make the person doing it feel better about their life decisions, I guess. For me, it's, it's like the equivalent of jangling keys in front of a baby. I feel like it's a strange... Infant, infantile... Infantile? It's infantile. It feels infantile. Don't be treated like a baby. But yeah, they added a voice recognition thing where uh, if during the course of the video you say like or subscribe, it will highlight the relevant buttons on the page for whoever's watching. 
So I could conceivably make a video where I say nothing but like and subscribe, like and subscribe, like and subscribe, like and subscribe, over and over and over again, and it will just keep lighting up on the page till someone clicks it, and they get a little shower of sparkles, and you know, I get to avoid being put back in back in the torment nexus for an extra week. Right, you gotta you gotta hit that sparkle quota. What the, it's what the algorithm demands these days, apparently. That's the new matter. You need to hit the sparkle quota. I, I honestly find it really funny how violent those chickens are. <laughs> Absolutely fucking wallop you in the face. It is very much ching, sparkle, sparkle. If it did that, I'd be happy, but it doesn't do that, so I'm sad. <laughs> These jesters. This level's been kind of interesting. It's actually had me loop back around do a second circuit of the level for progress. I always find that kind of fun when it's pulled off. In a, in a, in a good way. Not everything can get away with it. But I like it when it's done well. Oh, fuck. It's the yell! Yeah. See if I can... Ah, uh, it's fun. Ah, uh, so I was reading something else here. Twitch removed sub gifts and prime subs from counting towards channel states. I think I remember that, yeah. They've been trying to lock down, yeah, people getting easy requirements or whatever. Ninjas, hey, hey. How the other 999 hanging? As well as yourself, obviously. So. Healed. Does this make me invincible? My camera blocks the skeleton on the between level screen. God damn it! You're not you're not specifically missing much, I gotta be honest. He's he's just standing there. It's why I've got the backup skeleton in in, in, in the back here. was timing in multiple senses of the word I got shot just as I pressed use while trying to you know, interact with the clock so it just made it look like I was yelling at the clock weird <laughs> get out of here oh fuck he's back here get back here get back did I get him? I got him! What does the purple goop do again? I'm trying to I'm trying to figure out. Is it health? What am I what am I fighting for? Why am I why am I chasing the treasure chicken? I've never asked this question before now. Why exactly am I chasing the treasure chicken? It's just fun. I don't, I don't, I don't think I need an explanation or a reason. Divic just wanted to say, I'm making mornings less boring at work. Much appreciated. It certainly makes me feel like I'm doing a good job. There's no one, no one, no one should have to feel bored. I do it just because of the loot. 
Yeah, but I'm not even sure what the loot is. I've, I've, I've killed several treasure chickens now. Which probably qualifies me to being a serial killer. And the most I can recognize that I've gotten out of a chicken is a spare grenade, which I often use just to get the chicken in the first place, and then some purple goop. But of course. But of course. I did get a key, didn't I? I got a green key. Oh my god! Jesus. Fucking massacre! <laughs> oh my god, how am I supposed to deal with that? Uh, right. Oh, there was health at the top. There was, no, oh, there was a shield at the top. He got away? Bullshit. Bit late. Bit late. No one asks how the chicken's doing. Well, if he'd stop for a friggin' second, maybe I could. I think maybe it's health that I pick up. Are those doot skulls mounted on a pitchfork trumpet as if they're playing the midi kind of they, they get a little uh they they argue a little sometimes if you pay enough attention to them start getting a bit antsy There's a stun mechanic as well. Some weapons just incapacitating them briefly. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's all health. But I guess because it goes into your overhealth, there's there's your incentive for chasing the chicken. was a relevant door around here some this is the one I came in through yeah The only thing I can think of whenever I fire this is the phrase, get boofed. I think this is, I'm, I'm just going to call this the boofer. So yeah, one skull throws up into it. The other two help you cock the handle. They also seem very excited whenever I fire. Nice like that. Cat just fart. Oh god. This is such a cat heavy level. Yep, 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 yep. Glad I did that. One thing he feels a missed opportunity is the jump sounds should have been bone rattling. 
It's also very... It's a very short jump. See, now I feel like I'm just killing an entire tribe of those cats from Monster Hunter. Look at the palicos. Leave no cat alive is the achievement I just got. <laughs> oh my god. All right, you want to you want to see the you want to see him? There he is. There he is. He's having a fun time with his skull friends. Okay, now you know he does he does that at the end of every every level. You just you love the skull storm from Undying. Love it every time they start arguing with each other before you launch them at the enemy. I need to play Undying. Is that Clive Barker's Undying? Or am I getting that confused with Clive Barker's Jericho? And are they both Clive Barker's? They're both Barker's? Woofers? Are they are they sub subwoofers? Both? Good. What was the Mary? Which reminds me, I want to watch uh, Hellraiser again soon. And Hellraiser 2. Hellraiser 1, Hellraiser 2. It's a good double bill. Skip the third one. That's the really angry one. Okay, that's the spicy chicken. You can tell because he's big, red, and angry. I do like that little weapon acquisition noise as well. Like I say, cozy. It's very cozy to me. God damn it! Apart from when I get punched in the face. You remember reading Hellraiser was a different experience compared to watching the movie? I don't think I've read the book. Oh, that's his end point. Right, I was wondering what that was. So if you stop him from getting to it, actually, come on. There's no missed opportunity, is it, really, when you can rewind? I keep forgetting that I can do that. Lion, Hellraiser, you watched the 2022 Hulu movie. Give it a watch, actually good. Oh, cool. I was wondering about that, you know. I'll have to find out what my local equivalent uh, service for Hulu is because I don't think we natively get Hulu here in the UK. But I do want to watch that one. I do want to watch that version. I'm interested in it. Oh boy. I wonder if you can get a mod of this where it's just filthy Frank yelling, It's time to stop! Whenever that guy turns up. Ah! Okay, what the fuck? No! Oh! I love this game. There's just 
yeah, a simple joy to it. Let's see, exit. I've got red. None of the others. Oof. 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 Oh shit, I really fucked up that grenade toss. Ah! There we go. <laughs> I always feel sorry for those enemies. Oh. Oh my god, I'm focusing too much on the treasure chicken. Oh, it's these... It's infighting as well, I just saw the chicken kicking the shit out of a goat. That's a sentence I wasn't expecting to really have to say. Why are you gonna do lies P? Look at some of these enemies, you think it's a stalker mask from it. That was the other thing that I, I really wanted to play today. Maybe I'll have a chance later. I really, I really, really want to continue playing Lies of P. It just, it seems to be getting more and more enjoyable the further I play. It's very good, very good thing. How do I get that green key? Ah, no! Getting jump scared by these guys. <laughs> it's very fitting for, for spooky season. So how do I get around that one? I didn't go up this way, did I? That'll be why. Fuck! Damlo, seriously love this game to bits. Beat it in a couple of set sittings yesterday. Good to hear. Oh my god! I'm making a mockery of my big boofer. Alright. Alright. Definitely going for the switch. Press it? I think I pressed it. <laughs> Every time I turn around, it seems to be like just a chicken in my face. Bastard. testament to the the personality that these enemies are given where you do not want to let that chicken get away just because he's being a little <laughs> cocky bastard when he gets to his uh, his exit point and yes to, to quote the Tekken announcer chicken when's new Tekken out there's another one I want to play I want to play some Tekken woofed Boofed. Oh, wait. More and more agents volunteer. Only to fail again and again. Poor guys. That's my co workers, damn it. Tekken's out January 24th. That long? Wow, I didn't think it was going to be next year. I thought it was going to be this year. I thought it was going to be before Christmas with the rate that they were putting out character videos. But I am I am in the right frame of mind to want to pick up a fighting game. Like, right. I'm going to pick up one fighting game. 
It better be freaking good. Oh, shit. He arrives. <laughs> uh, I, I will say that this is probably one of my favorite weapons. The Xylobone. Is uh, Mortal Kombat 1 any good? Uh, I'm not into Mortal Kombat. I don't know if it was good. People seem to be enjoying it. Oh my god! I was interested in the fact that they've got that, um... What was it? DLC with superheroes from various shows like uh, Homelander... Uh, whatever his name is from Invincible. Oh! <laughs> yeah, it's absolutely fact that they scream their heads off shortly before punching you. That, that really gets me about those chickens. Omni-Man! Ah, that's the name. That's the name of the other guy. I think there was another one in, uh, in Mortal Kombat, but none of it really... Is anything I'm all that interested in? I don't know. I think it's that, that style of, uh, fighting game. I'm not into it so much. Three health and a dream. Any minute now. Oh my god. Come on! There we go. Another Street Fighter as well, but it, like I say, I've, I've got more of a history with Tekken than any of those. I do, so, shut up! Play Mugen. If I want crossovers. I mean, there's that. Fuck. That's what I mean about the salamanders. They can send their fire over everything. Jeez. I am playing this on hard. For anyone wondering. I'm, I'm not- I'm not terrible. I mean, I am. But... The difficulty isn't helping. Ah! I just want to get my xylobone out! I just want to whip my xylobone out in public. Is that... Is that too much to ask? Is that against the law? Oh, it's the kitties! It's not the goats, it's the kids! Fuck! Now it's the goats. Yeah. The fact that they do that widespread. I just can't see the uh, the widest one coming. Got no grenades. Teasing it is. I just realized that they fire from the udder. I think. Do they fire through the- no, it looks like they fire from their mouths, but they kind of grab their bellies. They're just puking on me, aren't they? They're just puking on me. Rude. There we go. We're good. I just instinctively went to F6. I instinctively tried to quick save. Oh! 
lot of health. Can you even save manually in this game? I don't think you can. There's no need to. You can manually save? Oh! But yeah, there's no need to. I guess it's a holdover for people that can't get their heads around it. Why not both? Yeah. Why not both? No. I'll leave. I'll leave that treasure chicken for later. Oh Jesus! Oh, they're arguing. See that lunge? Jeez. That was an achievement. Cause a berserker to kill another enemy. Wow. That was completely by accident. Yeah. I think the chickens have a lofty opinion of themselves. Use quick saves because you don't like the rewind system. Kind of makes it so there's no consequence for death. You are the consequence for death. It's meta. You just keep coming back. That's a big hole. Is that where the chicken went? I'm gonna say maybe. So I got the green key, but I ain't got no red key. I missed the chicken. I know I missed the chicken. Oh my god. Honestly, those chickens keep scaring the shit out of me. They seem to come out of nowhere sometimes. If the chickens reach your... I, I, I know, I've, I've already been over this sorcery. I discovered that in the last level. Jesus! Chicken jump scares. This is chicken assault jump scare. They, 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 I'm paranoid as to where they come from. They, they just. Fuck! Oh, fuck. I didn't mean to do that. Right. Can, you, can you kill me? Yeah, thank you. I want to go back and get my grenade. There we go. chickens what seriously i am so paranoid about those fucking chickens they turned up that one time and i've not seen them again and i don't know if they died or they're stuck on something or what fuck how are you not dead there you go Oh boy. No! 
I wonder if the author of this has a fear of chickens. Ever been chased by a chicken? I haven't. I'm just wondering if anyone else has. Oh, put me off guard. Come back. <laughs> I want to get at least one of them. Hey. Oh. Chickens have always been ruthless in video games, you agree? The one's from Zoldor. Just like Stephen King said, Jamlo, the horror is not seeing the chicken. The horror is when you can't see it anymore. Where did the chicken go? True. True. You know the other thing that Stephen King said? He said, God, I love cocaine. Chickens are the birds that never forgot they were dinosaurs. It. They always manage to catch me when I'm looking the other way. What the fuck? It slows down as well because of the sludge. Oh, they can jump up. Well, that 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 explains it then. I just want to try it again. Get one shot, and then yeah. I just realized now I'm at the mercy of those snipers. Yeah. Cats just won't fuck off. Jesus. Can you not? I need to, I need to get in cover. Come on. Oh. <laughs> All right. All right. I've learned my lesson. I've learned my lesson. I haven't learned my lesson. There we go. Oh my god. Dog salivating audibly. <laughs> I am made out of bones. These cats are fucking awful to kill at range. Buffer, my beloved. We have retrieved the buffer. Get boofed. Oh, my 
my god, this is gonna get so disorientating. <laughs> Double jesters, teleporting everything, like, twice. Boof off, you mother boofer! Oh god, there's another one. Was that three? Come on. Come on now! Ooh! Ooh! It's gonna be this one cat, isn't it? It's gonna be this one cat getting teleported all over the place. Just pinging me in the backside. Some awkward spots, those fellas. Right, I think I got him. Again. Oh, son of a bitch. Yeah, they're so quick on the hit. It's like a cruel irony that they're a bow and arrow enemy, but they still just, like, hit scan you. Has this dev made other similar games? Uh, I wasn't aware of the dev before this game. gonna cash in my nope guard card nope guard that too protect me from nope the heck are you why are you horse I'm not I know I'm not gonna get any good answer but you know Yeah, if this is a, a debut game release, then, uh, wow. Heck of an opening statement. Oh, so that's what the horses do. They're awful. Right, where's the other horse? Oh, God. That's a pretty tough little level. <laughs> Dead. There we go. There's my xylobone. Oh. Allow me to play you the song of my people. That's something to watch out for. Didn't quite realize it till now that they had delay explosion. Oh god, this level's doing one of those everywhere you turn there's enemies kind of sections. Gets oddly intense. 
You kind of retreat, but nope. Everywhere you go, there they are. Suction? Something like that. This guy used to... What does work for Paradox Interactive. Oh, cool. But, yeah, still. You know, as, as, as a standalone solo project. Oh, this little fucker. Where is he going? <laughs> treasure chickens, man. Friggin' treasure chickens. So he kind of... Yeah, I don't even know. I don't, re I don't even know. I'm a little lost. But I'm sure that'll change. I got all three keys. Just wondering where I cash them in. Is it the top? I'm trying to figure out if I can get back to the top, actually. No, the chickens can. What with the vertical leap? that way. Ah. All games need treasure chickens. God! Do the flames... What's the pattern? It just caught me off guard. Just a wall! Line, this just stopped you starting a replay of Turok 2. <laughs> you glad it just did... Light layer of the blind ones. Oh, uh, yeah. That, that's definitely my least favorite level. I'm glad that they had the, uh, the protection power of the, just so it could show me the consequences of letting that power up enemy influence all of the other enemies around it. It really kind of hammers home. This is what the enemy's gonna do. Watch out for it. We'll give you a demonstration before we uh, give you the full, the full, full fat application of it. Ooh, I remember this one. This is fun. Before I get down to it though, I'm gonna get myself another cup of tea. Be right back. It's time to chew gas and kick bubble gum, and I'm all out of gum. I don't think so, Tim.
Yo. What did I miss? Give it back. I can uh, deflect the, the horsey grenades with my scythe. Good to know. Apparently they've spiced this level up a bit. But I imagine it'll have the uh, extra enemies that have been introduced so far in this. A bird serpent. Ah, so he lays eggs. But of course. Serpent ain't got shit that I can't deal with. Mostly. I got the red key. So that's three different types of chicken now. Regular. Berserk. What is the other one? The other one throws stuff. Sorry, I'm grooving. Short, but fun. I just wondering what the reach might be on that. Right, I'm just gonna get up where the cat was. There's nothing up there, fine. Just wanted to check. Wait, have I been up this one? Yes. Was Riki loved that the frogs have vertically rotating sprites? That is actually quite cool. Oh, god damn it! Where's he gone? Dead? Oh, 
they're annoying little bastards. They, they, they get up in the rafters somewhere and you wonder where you're getting shot from. Drive by grenading. Nope. <laughs> I think I'm using it on the wrong thing. Okay, maybe not the right situation. Yeah, my brain isn't getting the, the hang of that. Just because I can deflect doesn't mean it's uh, the thing I should be doing. My brain is injured. Seb, how am I? Not bad, not bad. I'm honestly so into this that I forget to check Twitch chat. <laughs> so, apologies. Apologies if I miss anything. I might have. Buenos dias, my fizz. <laughs> Thank you so much for the 60 months. Much appreciated, Zelna. You appreciate what the music is going for, Miss Dragon? Feels like the mix could be cleaner. It's a, it's, it's a vibe. I have absolutely, yeah, forgotten to pick up a key. Yep. Oh god, he's in here as well? Gets everywhere. Right, where is the nearest blue? Nearest blue door. I do quite like it how everything gets washed down river as well. It's kind of fun. Bastard! What the? 
rifling out all sorts of shit. Anyway, got there eventually. Oh god, they got bazookas now! <laughs> I always knew the horses would revolt. I never expected it would be like this. Are they wearing berets. <laughs> but yeah, this is just effortlessly fun. Also, I like the primary weapon. God damn it! Because uh, it, it feels like I'm slapping my enemies in the face from a distance. It's just the sound it makes. The sound is satisfying. Wrecked. Boofed. L plus ratio plus boof. Oh god, oh god. Oh Right, where's my where's my where's my xylobone? Have I got a xylobone? I don't have a xylobone. Why don't I have a I thought I had a xylobone. This is a you you walked into the wrong neighborhood, mother clucker kind of situation. Oh my god. Which Doom game is this? Uh, KFC, Colonel's Revenge. Someone stole his special recipe and now we've got to hunt them down. But in seriousness, no, this is Calcium Contract. Standalone. Not Doom. Not even GZ. Custom. <laughs> John Carmack made this during a fever dream after KFC food intoxication. Yeah, there, there was the other special ingredient in that one. There's the there's the xylophone. I don't care if it's not called the Xylobone, I'm, I'm absolutely <laughs> keeping that name. Alright. I now have all of the keys. Though, I'm having trouble remembering where all of the keys go. Because it's been a bit of a roller coaster of a map. If I loop back around this way, I'll, I'll try and pick up the thread again. Alright, so that was the chicken caves. Ah. Oh my god! I've got to admit, I do love the visual of the chicken serpent. Bird serpent, whatever it's called. As it flies around. Eesh. All right, health. Horses. And grenades. Oh. Yeah, that'll do. Fuck! I, 
like how sudden the deaths feel sometimes. Dead. You know, I gotta double check actually. I'm wondering whether I can shoot those uh, those grenades to detonate them. Detonate the detonator. I feel like I'm channeling my uh, 2018 self whenever I say, "Oh my god, yeah, it's been a while." <laughs> but that's how you know when I'm having, yeah. You know, an ironic fun. Right, so that opened up. Lava zone. Well, it fits that it'd be full of salamanders. So yeah. doesn't help me at all, but yeah, it's together. I wonder if they'll uh, re-record the, the detonator <laughs> line from Max Payne, or oh, the Max Payne remake. I, I hope they keep just the original lines. I hope they've got like the masters of those and they just put them back in in slightly higher quality. Because <laughs> to me, they're perfect. Absolutely perfect. They don't need to be changed. Ah, is that the end? It is! Fling yourself into the pit. They're doing Max Payne remakes? I believe so, I've heard. Unless I misheard. Maybe it's all lies, I don't know. How can I trust anything these days? Oh my god, we got different varieties of these little goobers. And they shoot fireballs. Fucking great. Great. I love the little <laughs> expressions when they're shot. Kind of cute. I'd get a plushie. I love it! There's so much to love. Oh my god. There we go. I like the idea that you can just get back at them by just lining yourself yourself up perfectly with the laser dot. <laughs> get down, Mr. President! Oh fuck. Missed that one, didn't I? Not my revenge, though. Mm. That's right. Get Xyla boned. Slight mistake, slight miscalculation. <laughs> oh, hello. Dead before you can do anything. Well, his ability shall remain a mystery. I need health. Of all the places to end up with a fried chicken junk, that would be, that would be the place. Oh man. 
man. I just I just can't say enough good things about the dynamics of combat in this. It's just it's it's breezy and at the same time just challenging enough. It's smooth. That's what I can say. It's smooth. Buttery smooth combat. Very little to get in the way of just having fun with it. Winnie on that. He won't be competing at the Grand National. <sighs> Those were horses, yes, those, those were indeed horses. Terrifying, upright horses. I mean, horses are terrifying in general. Oh boy, what are you? Damn it. Did he just backflip away from me in style? That's, that's unbelievable. Fuck you! Oh, fucking treasure chicken. He's long gone. <laughs> Got triple gold into the past. The fuck was that? Thought it sounded like one of you. I don't have my tea. <laughs> Fucking hell, they, they, they got no chill. They just don't leave me alone. Right, one health. This is fine. Perfectly fine. We can get by. You know, the treasure chicken would be... Would be the thing I should chase. But wouldn't you know it, he's a dick. So he pukes purple, but isn't purple, like, health? Oh, he, he's coming. He's coming. He, but... He's just loving life. That's all it is. <laughs> Should I fly the hell is this game? Calcium contract, innit? Bones in it. What do you do? You resurrect. Oh, <laughs> understandable. I'm sure hit scam weapons are better for the treasure chicken, Osric. Uh, another thing that's better for the treasure chicken is me not being slow as shit. Pipes. Snap up and peep. Honestly, one of those sound clips for the cats does sound like it's just passing gas instead of, you know, growling or whatever it's supposed to be doing. Just sounds like... Can you get some five-year anniversary dudes? 
Uh, let me let, let me just see if I've got any dudes around here. There you go. Zolna, thank you so much for the five years. What are you doing giving me money? 60, min 60 months. I completely forgot to fucking register that. But thank you. Thank you very much. Anyway. Revenge. Appropriate that the anniversary should land uh, land on a skelly mod, indeed. How fortuitous! Trying to distract me, eh? No, nope, no resurrecting. No resurrected chicken. No, nope, no, nope, no. Nope. Bad enough. I'm just being needlessly cruel now, busting in and breaking all the tableware and grandfather clocks. You know, I, I'm not I'm not sweating the, the treasure chickens. It's almost like secret hunting. If I've got the time, I'll be happy to go back and try and catch him in, an, in like a, a second playthrough kind of thing. But I still get the urge. It's it's like the uh, like the instinct to just chase. Oh my god! Honestly. Berserker chicken jump scares every time. Every time. Oh, yep, yep. Get me the xylobone. Xylobone, xylobone. Xylobone wins. I wonder if there's going to be any other weapons beyond these. Not that I feel it's necessary. I kind of like the, uh, the balance that it's got at the moment. Oh, fuck! I see ya, I see ya. Hooligan chickens. I might want to try chase that one. Nah, he got away there. Real easy. Where does he start? From when I pick up the key, I think. Ah, that feels like one of the better ways to do it. Get him with the boofer, it stuns him. Oh, 
Oh, yeah, I forgot about this. Okay, this is my new favorite. My new favorite. You just listen to the skull screaming into the distance. That's <laughs> great. Try it again. Get boofed. Okay, maybe you lot can get boofed from the corner. <laughs> ah! So that vomits purple, but purple is healy stuff, right? Like grape grape juice. Did that big thing just fall off the cliff? I think it did. The power of the sun. Skull in my hand, yes. So that's 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 why uh that's why that one's in the in the corner there. I was wondering about that one. I was like, well I don't see him pop up too often with the other skull bros. And now we now we do, now we have it. quicker than I thought they would. Buffer required. Oh my god! I didn't expect the fire to curve up the friggin' steps like that. These their flames are quite difficult for me to dodge. I don't quite get the pattern. Ah! Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I was terrified that I was going to get killed by that sniper cat. Oh boy. There's still time. For death, that is. Whew. Ellie, bye-bye. Thanks for dropping by. Reminds me of that, uh, that argument. What would you rather fight? Like a duck-sized horse. A horse-sized duck. Wait. You know what I mean, right? But with chickens instead. Horse-sized duck. Four hundred duck-sized horses. I think either is terrifying, really.
Xylobone, my beloved. of a perfectly good grenade. Sometimes I just get this reflexive urge to use mouse 2 to check if there's an alt fire on anything, but I know there's no alt fires. It's, it's just the grenade button. In this case. Want some? Have it. Suck my boofer. Go to sleep. Did I hit him in the nuts? What's up with the demonic chicken muppets? Long story. Back here. Back here! Oh god! Okay. Keep running. Whoop! Good job I got grenades. <laughs> Jesus section. Maybe you can probably deduce that I'm not into stuff like the Commodore 64 or ZX Spectrum. Before my time. Never really got into them. earliest machine I can remember using is like the Atari 2600. It, it was a tape deck loader for games. Like cassette tape. Which I thought was really, really cool. I still do. Games stored on magnetic tape. Like the kind you used to put in the car stereo. Ah! It's gold. Ah! Gosh darn jesters!
Doom Noob, that was surely around the same time, the Atari 2600. I, I, I think you underestimate how young I was at the time. Also, you also underestimate how many households would be capable of owning all of them. You have to be pretty fucking flush with money to be able to afford an Atari 2600, a C64, and a ZX Spectrum. Is it, is it, is it too much to expect me to maybe be familiar with just the one? <laughs> also, I was like four. <laughs> if that. Like, earliest hazy childhood memories. The serpent only grew bolder with time. The growth marked by broken bones of calcium agents. Rupert, you remember the most annoying thing for cassette loading was that you had to rewind it to the beginning, 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 beginning of a game. Yeah, I, re I recall it being a bit cumbersome. But it wasn't too bad. It had a pretty fast rewind. I remember playing, um, specifically games-wise, was like Cops and Robbers. It's very simple. But very cool. Sorry, I'm cracking up at the animation with the skull. He's like, nah, 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 nah. just having a grand old time. For those wondering, the MSX2 is similar to both the ZX Spectrum. Wasn't the original Metal Gear on the MSX2? And then there was a cut down version of Metal Gear for the NES. You got into older stuff as an adult? Ah, it's different strokes for different folks, isn't it? I'd love to say I could be knowledgeable about that stuff, but it's, uh... It's not the part of the tech tree that I filled out! I enjoy watching uh, LGR. Plus, I can imagine that I'd be um, a lot, a lot more broke if I was into that stuff. Especially if I got into the realm of collecting. Good grief! I, I am glad I am not geared for uh, excessive collection. I'm, I'm, I'm a bit strapped enough as it is. Uh. All right, I got the blue key. Blue door. There it is. Sure if I did. Some intense instances of combat here, isn't it? So, is this skull deflecting the rockets? It is. Stupid 
bird serpent getting in the way. It's reminding me of an Asher painting. gonna check the time. Should be alright. You know, it's that kind of thing. I get I get a little carried away with these games. Fun and it's so enjoyable. Ah that There's like zero <laughs> There's like zero space to do a chicken chase. That one's on me. Definitely. <laughs> Definitely on me. That noise that the horse made reminds me of the sound that... Is it elk? Or, or moose? Probably an elk. Sound that an elk makes in the wild. It's terrifying. If you don't know what it is, it's like, what the heck? Wouldn't want to be out camping and hearing that noise like in the in the in the early early hours of the morning. I keep doing it. Oh, God damn it. It's like three in a row. Where's the other one? Hey! Whew. Oh yeah, there's the re-releases of uh, Metal Gear soon, yeah. Hopefully it leads to them to releasing Metal Gear Solid 4 on modern systems. That would be great. I, I hope that they're holding that for like volume 2. That would be a very notable notable release if that if that were the case i can't see them not doing it because it's 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 just money on the table there's the remasters of tomb raider coming out yeah are they doing tomb raider one two and three doing the trilogy feel bad for last revelation there's where's the love for that Just obsessed with keeping it neat with the trilogy. <laughs> My God, these horses. Oh my god. Well, you can sort off. Horses can follow. Have I got anything other than the skulls? I don't think I do. Oh yeah, I'm leaving. <laughs> Future generations will soon experience uh, Flash Atlantis from the first Tomb Raider. Oh god, yeah. It's gonna gonna freak some people out.
think uh, Bird Serpent is a little uh, little into himself or herself or itself themselves I'm not gonna comment on that because my mind's going my mind's going strange places I know it's gonna be like the Uruburus but stop farting at me Oh, God damn it. I wonder if that's a guaranteed stun. Send me back. Take me back. Further. Get rid of these first. Much offense in, did he? Tomb Raider 3 goes full of the thing with its Antarctic sections. They, they both they both get a bit a bit horror tinged. I just find it funny that a lot of people forget about those aspects of the original Tomb Raider games. Oh, I'll take a buffer. I'm hoping for the uh, the xylobone, but so I need a button. I got a red key. Raider Anniversary ruined Atlantis. I never played Anniversary. I'd always wondered, wouldn't more people be aware of fleshy Atlantis through uh, Tomb Raider Anniversary, but apparently not. Atlantis got changed to mostly dark stone Rooney Atlantis. Ah. Yeah, full send it. Full send the, the, the weird, the horror. But yeah, I like the idea of um, a rendition of Atlantis like that being so unique, because no one else ever seems to do that. When you think of Atlantis in, in, in other games, other media, to do it as like some flesh biomechanical nightmare that's that's cool I, I, no one no one fucking does that with the concept of atlantis i 
and the RuneScape aesthetic of the sprites. You know, come to think of it, now that you've mentioned it, yeah, there is a tinge of that. There is. I was one step ahead. Hey, now we got it. it's just as I realize this is the friggin' damage power. I could go back further, to be honest. But want to take full advantage of it. Actually, no, it doesn't turn up. It doesn't turn up till the, uh, the door opens. Yeah. Jeez. Health vanishes in this section, doesn't it? Go from 118. I am just missing terribly. Alright. Alright. Take it slow for a sec. Section's got no chill. Bloody hell. It's the friggin' Jester, that's what's making this a pisser. Stop burning alive now, sweet. And breathe. Finally! <laughs> God, that was, um, that was a tough collection of enemies.
Oh. So, right. It looks like there's two exits. Wait, no. No, there isn't. It was just the path to the exit. That's fine. That just leads back to the front of the level. Hey! Angered the chicken. Intended, but this is really heating up. Not the best weapon to be doing range with, but still got him. Wish the starting weapon wasn't so tinny. Ah, that's its charm for me. The thump. Actually, no, it's the wrong one. It's the boofer that does the the, the the trident. I I freely agree. That it would be better with a different sound effect. But what sound effect is there that's there is fine. I'd rather it toot. Yeah. Mother of mercy, come on. Anyway. <laughs> but yeah, the jesters uh, are, are rising up my ranking of irritation in terms of enemy types. Certainly one of the most irritating are the great salamanders, maybe the great goats. More like awful goats, am I right? Grenade horses, absolutely up there. Rocket horses, I'm not sure if rocket horses are better or worse. At least with the rocket horses, is just one projectile to dodge. So I'd probably say grenade horses. Ah, I think I've got a key there. Calcium contract forbids it. <laughs> what was in here? 
I might be fine, actually. It's still taunting me. My god, these chickens! Just when I'm thought I'm done with them. Shorter level than I thought it was. Yeah, I'd rather have a tight, impactful level something that draws itself out for too long. It's any day of the week. Another enemy I can hear. Got him. Got him. He was expecting uh, dentistry to him <laughs> with calcium contract as a name. No, you, you got you got skellies. You got skellies, and you'll like it. I know I do. Something that I completely failed to check is how long this game actually is. Levels-wise, how many levels? Scully's a good new book. Good to hear. Footbridge is going to be a bridge made of foot. I hope not. <laughs> denied. Just denied. No entry. The number of these fellas is too damn high. There we go. Speaking of FPS, Duke Nukem 3D, Save Your Babes version 0.9 came out. I'm not familiar with that one. Or if I was, I've forgotten. I'm wondering what the fellas on the uh, Duke Nukem Forever reclamation project are, uh, are up to. I know they worked on a lot of multiplayer Duke match stuff for forever. Not too long ago. You get to see uh, what else they might be looking up. Oh god, they just hatch instead of breaking? Okay, I'm getting womboed. Okay. 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 I think I see the source of the problem. There's 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 a clock guy and he's really hyping everyone up. 
I say my, my deaths are so abrupt in this at the moment that all I can do is like flinch. Happens. <laughs> I'm going back this way. There's less flames over here. Oh god, is there like two clock guys in this? Mother of mercy, my health went minus 76. That's not even fair. Dude! Ugh. Ah! Just give me a moment! What did I just say? What did I just fucking say? You chickeny assholes! This action is fucking relentless. It's it's the sniper cats at the back as well that are really fucking me up. Just when I think I'm safe from anything else. It's either a barrage of rockets, sniper cat, chickens. Fucking death, you know. Please. Come in, Ert. Right, where's that fucking cat? Actually, no, I'm gonna take out the clock. Alright, he's done. I'm so grateful for the save system in this. Honestly, I am. Because this would be pain if I was just dealing with the, my usual inability to use quick saves, probably. Okay. Okay. Die! <laughs> ah! First try. Sorry, I got spooked by my own pickup there. I was like, oh god, is that an enemy? No, it's just my, my spicy skull. Freaking terrible. Where are you going? I did get the rest of them with that stray shot earlier. That's good. Fuck! Honestly. 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 <sighs> giving me anxiety, those fucking chickens. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I'm just going. I'm going. You watch me. I'm going. You can't stop me. I'm going.
Oh, is this me Manelli at the top? Woo! Hey! Are you gonna die yet? No? Okay. Okay, we can afford to go back further than that. And, and that, absolutely. Floaty fellas. Eh. It's like a variation on the wall of faces from Doom, isn't it? Just with cats. Neat. I mean, I can get through that one as well. Or it does. <laughs> Is the blue like a stun? Feels like it is. It's like I'm spanking them from a distance. This is harassment. Is the grenade usable with all weapons? Uh, I don't think it's usable with the fire skull. I think. I don't know. I haven't tested it. There's no way for me to know. Look, that they, they, they pincer you. It's evil. So aggressive. Oh boy. Sometimes I have, like, a frame of a chicken running directly into my sight, and then I'm dead. Because of the splash damage. And of course there's a jester, of course there's a fucking jester, fuck you, fuck you. Just the flames! I did not come here to be flambéed today. Oh, 
Oh, they disappear quite quick. I thought they'd just keep screaming off into the night sky. I just wanted to test it. You can see why the rewind system's a thing now, Zikri. Very brittle. You can almost say that I don't drink enough milk with the calcium. As if there should be a contract. I was going somewhere with that. It didn't quite land. No. Get back here. Get back here, you little bastard. As far as I can tell, every projectile is potentially deflectable in this. Which is neat. Not that I have a chance to do it very often, because I don't think my reactions are good enough. Ah. Horse. All we're missing is a horse in the gas mask. politeness, I would humbly request all jesters, go fuck themselves! Fuck! You could say I'm feeling rattled. Skeletons drink milk or just bathe in it. Bathe. Oh, I do find it endlessly funny the mental image of like a skeleton just necking an entire carton and it just dribbling all over the place. What the f fuck even is that? There was the defense power up. Industrial district. Hi. Yeah. I'm, go I'm going this. Oh, shit. I thought I had. I, I, I thought I was free to explore the facilities, but no. Those grenades don't, um, do self-damage. At the very least. You can use them point blank. Nope, 
no, 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 back. 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 There we go. We're good. Okay. Now I can prepare a little bit more adequately for this, uh, warm reception. Ow. Right in the jawbone. I'm not sure how I feel about those, uh, those conveyor belts. Maybe I'll go up this way. These conveyor belts. The most disorientating thing so far. Let your turn, damn it! mean it by berserk don't they it just unpromptedly beats the crap out of its brethren no 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 Wanna get that health Does he spawn directly behind me with that chicken chase? It's fucking awful. <laughs> oh no, no, he, he comes around the corner. Not quite as bad. Hard work. Hard work! <laughs> Two jesters. Two. My um, my xylobone. Where's my xylobone? This is unreasonable. Hostile working conditions. I don't think so. So, from what I can tell, the color of the uh, the old rewind function here denotes how much health you got. I don't think so, Jim. Oh, hey, they fell into the soup. Great. 
Oh wait, no, they came back. That sucks. That's not allowed. How are they allowed to cheat death, but I'm not? Well, I mean, I am death. I didn't think that through. I'm seeing the Jabba the Hutt references. And Pizza the Hutt. See, the sting is only temporary when it comes to failure in this. It's that kind of you know, immediate... Back into the... Back in, immediate back into the action kind of thing that means it doesn't, it doesn't sting you for too long. Finally. <laughs> I keep forgetting how short the jump is. <laughs> like, excessive gravity. Then I realize I ain't got no muscles in my legs. It's just bone. I love just the sheer aggression of the powered up Xylobone. Right. Less meat equals more gravity, more meat equals force to apply against gravity. How do you think you can stand up against that overwhelming force? And then there's, there's a question of too much meat. I'm sure there's a more accurate equation for this, but you know, I, I ain't good with numbers, so. Right. Archvalve height room setup. Oh, yeah. I could easily see that. How's the calcium intake? Hi! Is it possible to suffer a calcium overdose? Thank <laughs> you. 
often the action in this gets so intense it's just like you can't you can't tear your eyes away from it. It just demands your attention. Ah! Oh really? The auto mod doesn't like the word boned? Are you kidding me? What? And boning? What? What puritanical setting is that? Good grief. Quick, someone type Fanny into the chat. I want to see if it doesn't like Fanny. F-A-N-N-Y. It's funny. <laughs> it's a bit more esoteric. Fanny is just a bum in America. A bottom, if you will. A derriere. A posterior. A fart hole. A body. No, you don't say booty. In the in the United Kingdom we see body. Bot bot. There's a bit of body on that totty. Sorry, I just sound like an average Tory voter now. Sorry, I'll, I'll, I want to keep politics out of this. I think in the UK, fanny is the, um, <laughs> what's the other phrase that we have in the UK? Front bum on a, on a, on a lady. Yeah, I don't think I was prepared for how relentless the combat was going to be in this. I know I picked a higher difficulty, but still. I'd be sure that even on, uh, like, medium difficulty... Excuse me. Even on medium difficulty, it'd be, uh, a bit spicy at this stage. <laughs> Camel toe needed to be approved. <laughs> Oh, dear me. pickups the pickups startle me for the for the skulls why am I not hitting that Out of the lava. It's like that. The flames pull double duty. They kind of obscure, like, the hit scan cats. Do you have a feeling the auto mod blacklist is basically the Pornhub <laughs> comment section? Please, Pornhub comment section is very civil.
these show bobs. Show bobber. They're very polite. Am I even going? This way. Have a great day. I'm just trying to figure out the best way through this that gets me some extra health. These fucking salamanders. One of them sections. Ah, uh, that kind of explains it. Just chaos, isn't it? find it funny though this this does often require a deceptive bit of accuracy it's showing me how kind of off the mark i can be sometimes in my aim Sometimes I catch myself thinking, is it really that far a backtrack to use the key that I just picked up? Surely not. <laughs> eh. Fuck off with your fat, belchy bastard mouth. You stay there. Get rid of that fucker. Oh god, the goats are back. Something resurrecting them? That thing's horrifying. Reminds me of that SCP that, um, when you see an image of it, it starts tracking you down. Of course, of course, of course there's a sniper cat! I'm, I'm going inside. I'm going inside. Fuck this place. Fuck this. I'm going this way.
the range on some of these friggin' attacks catches me off guard. Like you really can't half ass your way through a lot of these encounters. You you really gotta you gotta you gotta entire ass it. You gotta whole ass. Whole ass and whole ass. <sighs> okay. Not expecting another one. <laughs> oh, this looks penultimate or final. I'm gonna have to do it now. Chicken! that health bar I'm just looking at that health bar trying to understand it <laughs> uh, so he's kind of working a little lot uh, did, did El Oscuro ever split into like smaller versions of himself in Rise of the Triad my brain wants to tell me that's a thing Fuck me. And here I was worried that it wasn't going to be too significant a fight. It's funny, every sudden death knocks you further back in time, so I am losing progress. Salamanders. It can get very difficult. Man. Man. Losing the ability to even. Ah. 
that horse came out of an egg. This throws up many questions. Questions that I'm not sure I really, really want answering. Bird Serpent Jump Scare, man. This feels like a perfect Halloween game right now. It really does. My goodness, it's just chaos! What. The. Bug. I can't see shit. Sensory overload. Sensory overload! I'm not kidding. This is sending me just my eyes are bouncing. I feel like I'm making no progress. <laughs> ah! Jeez! So many fucking horses! I don't- I don't need any more- I don't need any more fucking salamanders. More horses. Or any more of these other fucking enemies for that matter. Well, that's one of them. I am desperately trying to get myself some health. I see it, but every time I dive for it, it's like a shitload of enemies or fire. Yeah, I fucking chicken. I've got to admit, it's a fun idea, especially with the way the health bar's working. It's really, it's really interesting. I mean, it's making me go insane, but it's really interesting. God, Ufa. Fuck. Fuck. I think I got one by accident. Purple drank, come on. No! That charge is fucking lethal. Dead. Yeah, come on. Come on. Bill, this is the longest stretch of me staying alive in this fight for a while. Hey! Oh! <gasps>
It is done. The bird serpent is no more. That was a hard fought death. <laughs> what difficulty is this? Uh, hard? The contract has been fulfilled. And it's time for you to leave the island. All that lives must die. And all adventures have come to an end. Hey! <laughs> that was a lot of fun. Would easily recommend. Yeah, it's not long, but it's just so fun. And it's, it's adorbs. Totes adorbs. But yeah, as far as an endgame boss goes, woo! Seriously, does that just cycle? Uh, those are really short credits! <laughs> That's it! <laughs> uh, free sound, uh, resources and all that kind of stuff. Interesting. So yes, uh, how many levels was that? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. Yeah, I played that on Cruel difficulty. There's Merciful, Fair, Cruel, and then Macam, which is the hardest difficulty. Which I may have to give a try at some point. Ah. Hey! <laughs> ah, that was a blast. That was a blast. Yeah. I feel like that could I could easily do with more eyes on it. And uh, as for the stream, this fits neatly into me having to get the heck out of Dodge because I've got to go pick up a child from nursery. So, thank you so much for dropping by. I hope you've enjoyed. I've certainly enjoyed myself. And I... Will I be back tomorrow? I may be back tomorrow. I might try and carve out... Carve, carve out... I'm going to try and get my words working. I'm going to try and carve out some time to play more Lies of P. And... Uh, then Friday, I've got Siren, do mod madness live. Um, new update to that mod. I have streamed it in the past, but from what I've seen, there's like a huge suite of uh, additions and improvements. So that's going to be my Friday pick. And until next time, this has been Mr. Icarus. Thank you very much for watching. Icarus out.